Hi everyone. In this video, I am going to explain about waveguide phase shifters. So, what do you mean by phase shifter? What do you mean by phase shifter? I suppose if it is a device I am having in and the input is having a signal with a no phase shift, then after passing through this phase shifter, it will be experiencing a phase shift of 90 degrees or 180 degrees or 270 degrees or 360 degrees, depending upon the type of uh, uh, material and something we are using over there to have a phase shift in the transmitted signal. So, with this concept inside the waveguide, when a wave is being traveled inside the waveguide, whether it may be a circularly polarized or vertical or a horizontal polarization, the wave when it is travels inside the waveguide, it will be experiencing a phase shift of something that we want. Okay, that is the use of phase shifters. So, see here an example figure I uh, have got a reference waveguide. A reference waveguide is a plane waveguide where all the signals can easily pass through from here to here. Okay, and it is the glide symmetric phase shifters where a small amount of uh, connecting particles are placed over the uh, transmission line in between whenever the signal goes and touches this particular one here it will reflected back again touches this one reflected back so likewise if uh, set of phase shifters are being uh, used or incorporated here when it will be having a different phase shift compared to the normal or reference section okay see here all these are traveling normally but in the uh, second uh, signal the glide symmetry phase shifter it will be having a phase shift off over here see another type of signal has been made because of this knob so whatever grown across this one particular one okay so this is the way how we can uh, uh, incorporate uh, some phase shift in the transmission line now how to insert a phase shift how to insert a phase shift. See here a signal is directly taken without any phase shift and that is passing through a buffer. Apply some delay for the same signal. After that, that delayed signal and the original signal, these two are applied to a mixer. Then it will be giving a phase shifting concept. Okay. So, now let us see A phase shifter, a phase shifter is a two port device whose basic function is to provide a change in the phase of a change in the phase of RF signal in the phase of in the phase of RF signal with practically negligible attenuation okay so whatever it is when we are using in this phase shifter it should not violate the signal so the same rf signal with the uh, Practically negligible attenuation, it can easily provide a phase shift of required amount. Okay, so the phase shift basically depends on the length of transmission and operating wavelength. The phase shift basically depends on basically depends on the length of transmission line the length of 
transmission line and operating wavelength and operating wavelength okay so phase shifters are of two types phase shifters are two types what are they first one is adjustable phase shifter adjustable phase shifter and second one is non adjustable phase shifter okay so there are two types of phase shifters are generally available first one is adjustable phase shifter second one is non adjustable phase shifter so what do you mean by adjustable and what do you mean by non adjustable variable phase shifters so adjustable phase shifters consists of a feeder section i'll write few points regarding the adjustable attenuator and the non adjustable attenuator adjustable attenuator so adjustable attenuator is nothing but sorry adjustable phase shifter sorry sorry adjustable you know we are dealing about phase shifters adjustable phase shifter now adjustable phase shifters consist of a feeder section it consists of it consists of a feeder section that introduces the phase shift that introduces a phase shift that will introduces a phase shift at a certain frequency at a certain frequency so definitely whenever we are introducing a signal into that uh, electromagnetic signal at particular frequency it is going to be added it is going to be converted that means a phase shift of the signal can be varied the magnitude of the shifts can be adjusted as required the magnitude the magnitude of the shift can be adjusted as required okay so this is about uh, something related to this adjustable phase shifter now let us see non adjustable phase shifter another one is non adjustable phase shifter so in the case of non adjustable phase shifters so non adjustable phase shifter shifts are consisting of a phase calibrated feeder section it consists of a phase calibrated a phase calibrated feeder section phase calibrated feeder section the phase shift in the section is provided by selecting the desired the phase shift in the section is provided by selecting the desired length the desired length 
cross sectional dimensions cross sectional dimensions or effective dielectric constant or effective dielectric constant effective dielectric constant so this is about non adjustable phase shifter now let us see a few applications of these phase shifters where we can better use these phase shifters first one used in a variety of communication and radar system used in radars and communication engineering also okay so microwave instrumentation and measurement systems microwave instrumentation and measurement systems okay so these are the few applications of this what is that phase shifters okay thank you